My name is Max Hess. I'm the Interim Executive Director of Fellowship of Reconciliation based in Nyack, New York. Okay, so um, Max, uh, why Charlottesville? I went to Charlottesville on the eventful weekend for a couple of reasons. I have been following Charlottesville for a while. Charlottesville is at the forefront of doing reconciliation and reparations work in the United States. They are looking into their history, talking about what to do with the Robert E. Lee statue, what to do with the name of the park, but also, very importantly, a reparations piece. As an example, a neighborhood was destroyed in Charlottesville in the 1960s called Vinegar Hill. And all of the people were moved into public housing. One of the measures is to provide city-funded scholarships to all of the children living in, still living in that public housing. Those three measures were part of what Charlottesville was doing, and that attracted the attention of the white supremacists, all parts of it. It's no accident that they were headed to Charlottesville. The other piece of it was, for me, was they were calling their movement Unite the Right, and they were trying to come together as a more unified, organized political force in the United States. And it was important to be there and meet them right at the outset, to confront them with active nonviolence, which is what Fellowship of Reconciliation stands for, and to do it at the very inception of their political movement. Um, and that was why Charlottesville. Okay, so um, how does uh, this action, um, you going to Charlottesville, fit into the broader fame or the legacy of, of the Fellowship of Reconciliation? The piece is, the Fellowship of Reconciliation historically begins as a pacifist organization opposed to war making and participating in war making. And over time, with the advent of additional thinking through Gandhi and Martin Luther King Jr., we have begun to understand pacifism in a new way, in an additional way, which means active nonviolence. So confronting the supremacists in Charlottesville, right as they're organizing, but doing it in an active, nonviolent way is squarely in the tradition of fellowship or reconciliation. 